Hey everyone, this is a vegetable called Romanesco. It's basically just a different kind of cauliflower. And what my wife has been doing with both cauliflower and this vegetable, Romanesco, is she's been pureeing it kind of like mashed potatoes. We're gonna show you how we do that here. Um, basically, you're just gonna need cauliflower or Romanesco, some butter, some garlic and a food processor or a little bit of time to puree it but we'll take you along for the ride and show you how we've been doing this so the first thing you're going to want to do is take the leaves off your cauliflower or romanesco you can just cut at the base of the stalk to take it off then you're going to want to trim it up so you got little pieces of your cauliflower romanesco to put into your a pot to steam them in and what you'll want to do is then after you've got them cut up you'll want to steam them until they're tender and then preferably while the uh, vegetable the Romanesco is still uh, steaming you'd want to cut up some garlic and saute that in some butter or some oil we prefer the flavor of butter so we're gonna do it that way we got a little sidetrack so our Romanesco is already done steaming, so we're gonna saute up this garlic here, and then we'll take you for the last few steps. Then you're gonna wanna load up your uh, Romanesco, already steamed into the blender. You can use cauliflower too, like I said originally here, and get that good and pureed down to the consistency of mashed potatoes. While you're food processing it, you'll want to add a little bit of milk and push it around a little if it's sitting above the blades, but just about a splash of milk, not a lot. You'll then want to add your uh, toasted garlic in there. And food processor it some more. You're also going to want to add about a couple of teaspoons of salt. I guess salt to taste is what the recipe says. And then you're going to want to add uh, cream cheese to get it to the consistency taste of mashed potatoes also. It's probably going to be about half a cup of cream cheese. So we taste tested it and it was really good. Um, we don't go out looking for this weird Romanesco vegetable, or at least originally we didn't. It showed up in our CSA farm box, the subscription farm that we're a part of. And I think we would go out and buy it now if we saw it, but it's uh, basically cauliflower. It's really cool looking and it tastes great and it, it turns into a cool puree like this but yeah thanks for watching bye